going on out there YouTube? What's up Team Hollywood and what's up the Madden 25 community? The Madden community. It's your man, Hollywood Sports. If you are new to my channel, thank you for clicking on my video and welcome to Hollywood Sports. We are here to talk about Madden 25 and EA. Why does EA program the game the way they do? Not just Madden 25, but every year. Why does EA program the game the way they do? That's my question. And I'm going to give you guys some points so you can answer this question. Okay. When you look at Madden 25 right now, we know the defense is pretty much broken, right? Online. I mean, franchise mode. The defense is struggling. And some parts, and I'm gonna talk about that. Okay, when you play the CPU in all Madden, look at that defense. They play great defense. They shade. They look for work. They bracket players. I mean, they're doing it all. They're getting a pass rush. They're doing it all, guys. When you play all Madden, now, can anybody tell me I'm wrong? When you play all Madden. The CPU defense is on it. They're looking for work. They're doing everything, guys. They're pressing. They're, I mean, they're just doing everything, right? But when your defense gets on the field, it's broken. Okay? When a user defense plays on the field, they play bad defense. Now, I think, in my opinion, when you play all Madden, uh, they program the game for difficulty levels. No problem. No problem at all. They want it to be tough for you to score on the defense, right? So they got the defense playing. So if they're capable of the CPU playing good defense, why can't the user defense do the same? EA can do it in a heartbeat, guys. They have, the developers have a slider also. They don't have to make no big changes. All they got to do is tighten that defense up on their sliders, their programming sliders. For the coverage and it'll play just as good as those guys the cpu plays in all madden okay they do that for difficulty levels so it's just a challenge so when you play all pro the defense reactions may they're going to play good defense but their reactions aren't as fast their awareness is aren't as their awareness is not as good then you go down to pro then you go down to rookie that's how they do it, guys. So when you play all Madden, the defense is going to be on top of everything. Now, that's understandable. That's how they they do their difficulty levels, right? They tone it down as you come down a rookie. Their, re their reaction time and awareness is not as good as all Madden. That's all fine and dandy. But why can't they have the user defense play the same way at the same level? Right? We still got to go up against the defense. So it's a challenge for us. But the, deep, the, the user offense, they make it easy for them in all Madden. And they got our defense playing like crap. Right? Maybe they can keep it the same way, but they can't keep it the way they got it. Okay? And it tells me they're not testing the game or they don't have time to test the game. Because... Here's my question though. How come in the beta, it's not like that? When we play the beta, our defense is playing just as good as their defense. But why every time at release, it changes from the beta? So it's not that EA is not capable of giving us a good defense. They did it in the beta. But here's the issue, guys. They do it every year, right? They do it. They change it from the beta every year. It's because when they get feedback and the suits are going to see the feedback, they tell the devs to tone it down. People are complaining about it's too hard. Uh, I'm throwing too many interceptions. I don't understand why they do that. It's When you play all Madden, it's still going to be a challenge for the user. But it's, it's, it's when people play head-to-head, -head, right? 
People complain. It's too hard. I'm trying to play a game. This is not real. Why y'all making it so hard? And that's when it changes from the way it was in the beta to how it's released. Okay? That's the difference every single year when they get the feedback. They change the game. Now, all men, again, I can understand the difficulty level. It's supposed to be tough to pass and run and block and pick up blitzes. But they can't just throw out the user defense and where it's broken. Okay? And I don't think they intend to break break the defense the way it is right now. Obviously, they just don't test it or they don't have time to test it or they figure we'll just fix it uh, on the update. All they got to do is tune, tune sliders up for coverage and tighten it up. Guys will be back. They can do it just like that. But there's other things they got to fix so they ain't going to bring that out and they're going to bring it all out together. Okay. So that's the issue with defense. It's different from the beta every single year, okay? People complain, give their feedback. So that's what we end up with. Now, now let's let's talk about head to head. People might say, well, that's that's y'all playing against the CPU. But what about head to head? Head to head is the same way, guys. People complain, it's too hard. Um, I'm throwing too many interceptions. There's too many interceptions. I can't run plays. I'm not having fun. It's too realistic. So what do they do now? Head to head, they don't break the defense. They, I think there's percentages. They'll say, well, out of four plays, one play might be broken. Out of 10 plays, eight, two plays might be broken. They got a percentage on how these guys don't play right. And then when you playing head to head, you're screaming, how come my guy did this? Why is he not playing his own? Why is he running to the upper side of the field? In my opinion, I think it's done on purpose. Because they don't want the game to be too hard. They want the game to be fun. People don't want to get out here and throw interceptions. They want to throw touchdowns. Right? They want to get interceptions, but they don't want to throw interceptions. So I think there's some percentages. The way they program the game. The game plays good here, 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 here. And then the game plays bad here and here and here and here. I really believe that. And I think part of it is also is they don't test the game. I don't think those devs go play franchise mode. They, 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 it's impossible. They don't. Otherwise, they would see the obvious stuff. The percentage of devs that play this game is probably less than 5%, if that. I don't think they play this game. I think once you know the secrets of programming a game, it probably turns you off you know it's not really it's all fabricated to make the game work they, they don't want to play this game because they know the insides of this game you know I'm not saying it's a definite but that's how I feel that's why they don't play this game it's 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 obvious they don't play this game the devs do not play this game I'm sorry they don't when you tell them certain things they don't they don't have a clue what you're talking about you have to really explain yourself and, 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 and tell them what you mean. Otherwise, they don't understand it. That means because they don't play the game. But guys, that's all I wanted to talk about. They can make our defense play just as good as all Madden's defense. And the same thing in the head-to-head -head online. They can make these guys, these defenses play correctly. All they got to do is tune the reaction and the awareness down. They don't have to set it up where the, the coverage is broken. But I think that's a result of no test, well, lack of testing and a lack of playing the game. They take totally everything we say instead of what they think about the game, right? I don't think they have a clue of how this game plays. That's just my opinion. I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, it's all good. Somebody tell me I'm wrong. Somebody that's been inside the house, all right? I can only tell you what I, what I, what I, what I, what I'm seeing, all right? Let me start rambling, guys. I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on my next video.